Sabe com o Hibisco Finale. It's now official, folks. Bisco is back with a vengeance. Yung flaming arm niya pala yun, well, it, it, it explains in somewhat in the opening scene that while he was inside the Tetsujin's body, parang ina, inabsorb ng katawan ni Bisco yung yung rust na nakapaligid. Then while he was hearing uh, Milo call out for help, oh, okay. And he felt na that he, yeah, subconsciously, more likely that uh, he felt fully healed. Ayun, lumabas siya. So, ngayon, ang ikinagulat ni ng lahat, alright? Si Milo, si Pau, ja, even Jabi. Isang araw lang ang isut ni Bisco, naglala ang, ang, ang lumalabas ng mushroom, rust eater, ang sabi ko wi mismo. They were going for the kill, all of them. Biglang pumasok si Tirol at sinabi na, Teka muna guys, huwag nyo munang, huwag, huwag, nyo, huwag nyo itong palang ganyan yan. Kasi bina, binasa, niya yung, binasa niya yung manual ng Tetsujin. In order for the Tetsujin to stop, well, self-destructing, they have to take out the pilot. Bigla na ko na ng theory si, si Pawu. The, well, the Tetsujin has an iron mask for a face. Eh, kaya siguro. Palagay ko, nandyan si Kurukawa. Sa likod ng, sa likod ng maskarang yan. I can easily take out that mask with my pull technique. And, wow! Okay, so, um, that eventually becomes part of the plan. So, unang sumugod si Pawu. She easily took, she easily, Split the mask open. Ayun nga. Yung katawan ni Kurokawa ang nandun sa noo. Mismo ng, ng Tetsujin. Ah, sinabi na nung ni Bisco. Uh, proverbially. Tang, inakabuhay ka pa? Bisco was about to... He was about to... Uh, to to deliver the, um, the final arrow at Kurokawa's actual head. Binulag siyang ganon. Tinapunan siya, ng, tinapunan siya ng rust pero uh, Milo to the assist siya na mismo ang ang, uh, ang umasinta sa ulo ni Kurokawa pero akala eh, siguro akala ni Bisco na yung ulo ni Kurokawa ang puntirya ni ni Milo no he made the arrow fly in such a way na Akala ni Kurukawa nagmintis but no Siguro he had he also had his own theory that the the the, that the Sabikui seeks and destroys rust So pina pinatama niya sa malayong lugar Then naramdaman na lang ni Kurukawa that para may sumusugod sa kanya pagtingin niya isang batalyon ng mga rust eater So Uh, the Tetsujin was instantly enveloped in 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 Sabikui so much as kinain siya ng mga Sabikui and well, Kurokawa along with it tumbang Tetsujin so ang aftermath ganito eh well relak relak muna yung dalawa si Milo at si Bisco and they well eventually got down and Uh, sort of all is well kasi Pau uh, instantly assumed the post of governor sa umago sa pwesto ni Kurokawa and uh, according to uh, news flashes on TV she declared independence for Imihama so well final scene you still you guys still remember that that checkpoint na kung saan uh, napag-initan sila Bisco at Jabi because they were in disguise. Well, yung isang, uh, yung, yung batang babae na tauhan doon, she had a picture of both Milo and Bisco running off into the sunset. Excuse me.
Patreon, mga lifestyle. We're gonna break that episode down now for the final time. Critic Shop style. Peace! From the, um... Ka, ka, actually, the opening scene was an experience se- sequence kung bakit, uh, bakit nabuhay uli si Bisco. From the, uh... From the scene wherein, uh, yun nga, nakabalik na siya, up to the time na naitumba na nila ang Tetsujin, it was... It was, it was a what you call it, it was a re, it was a really tense pacing. Uh, talagang talagang action packed, right? Well, then it slowed down a bit kasi well, natural after mat. Kasi na uh, they uh, they completely uh, they've completely beaten the uh, the Tetsujin. Well, do I have complaints about the pacing of this episode, guys? Nope. Talagang, yung, yung pacing niya pang finale. Because, you either, uh, what you call this? Well, if you intend a, uh, if you intend to instill two-part finale feels to the audience, you start the pacing as early as, like, probably like, like what Sabi Ko Ibisco did the previous episode. Flow naman. Well, Uh, first gear shift here was when Bisco um, discovered uh, discovered the um, the god tier height of his powers. What did I call as a gear shift? No brainer, mga lifestyle. Because this is for everyone, probably except Bisco, who realized that. Wow. Bisco is now a god too. <laughs> uh, UK, yung assist the power with, with, with the mask. Yeah, that's just that's just a formality. But anyway, that was the second gear shift. Yung kay yung kay Pawu. she was able to uh, to unmask the Tetsujin. Final gear shift. Yung um yeah whoa, when. When uh, Milo through Bisco did the unthinkable. Kumaga nag long range uh, nag long range tracking siya. Ang intended target pa rin niya ang Tetsujin. Pero in order for it to um Kumaga kinapitalize niya ang kung ano pwedeng gawin ng ng sabi ko eh, dito sa dito, uh, dito sa halimaw na to. It was the most satisfying gearship of this finale. Natural. Because, well, Kurokawa is gone again, but for good. Plot wise. Hindi. Like I told you a while ago, guys, the, the opening sequence was an explainer sequence. Kung paano na buhay uli si Bisco. And, it's a good thing na ito ang inunan niya. Take two. It's a good thing na ito ang inuna nila. Because, well, I personally was left hanging as to how. Ha? Huh? Paano na buhay ulit ito? Ikinain na nga siya ng laba. Anong, ng, molt, ng molten rust. So. In short, malinis ang plot mga ka-lifestyle, Patreon. Because, well, you really need the audience to focus on how the lead characters are going to take out this monstrosity. And Oz ex- did exactly that. Talagang, maralandaman mong finale na, finale na talaga to. And, mukhang, yeah, talagang, nahir- talagang nahirapan ang mga bida rito. Because they're trying, they're trying their best to, um, to avoid setting it off Uh, too early kasi online self-destruct sequence eh. and the only way to to completely shut it off is to take out Kurokawa himself so ayun nakita yung tunay na nakita yung tunay na ulo ayun yun ang pilunter niya nila but uh, yeah eventually Milo had a better idea so he just uh, he just let Bisco fire that fire that um 
the, the arrow of his akala nga ni Kurokawa nag, nagminti si Bisco eh. sa malayo pa sa malayo pa tumama pero hindi niya alam that was Milo's plan he just let the sabi ko we hunt, him, hunt, hunt the Tetsujin down ayun kinain nilamon na ganun hanggang sa nawala rin si Kurokawa wow Uh, only a clean plot will make you uh, will make you um, will make you see this episode that way that I come wow a very satisfying end to a to a really hated big bad so pace flow and plot they all came together for this finale folks shut up now <laughs> excuse me so Sabi ko, Ibisco, finale! Napat lang. Two thumbs up! You know, yung... Uh, yung aftermath? It just left me one question. Eh. Will Sabi ko, Ibisco, be back for another season? For, for the rest of us, that's a good one. That's a good question. But... It's because of them. Si yan, si Biscot si Milo. Imihama was de- was able to declare independence from the Japanese government. Of course, courtesy of Pawu. Yung well. Now, na confirm na yung na confirm yung feelings niya kay Bisco. Yung bigla na niyang hinalikan si Bisco. It's quite a killing moment. All right? It's quite a killing moment. Mari ayaw pa ni Bisco. Ulul, gusto mo rin. <laughs> Magandang babae si Pao, kahit, kahit, kahit para ako yun. So, yeah, that's another question left unanswered. Kailan ba sila magkakatuloy ni Pao? Tapos, um, since, well, technically, Bisco and Milo are still wanted by the Japanese government. Pero, uh, they now have a, a strong political ally now. Of course, si Pao, She's now the governor of Imihama, who has just declared independence. And yeah, this is, if you deep dive into it, this is probably one of the reasons why Bisco and Milo are still wanted. For, uh, in the, uh, when, uh, to the rest of Japan. Kaya, to Imihama, they are heroes, but to the rest of Japan, they're still wanted criminals. Kaya, kung babalik man ito for season 2, baka dun, baka dun, baka yun ang gawing pundasyon ng storyline for season 2. Pero, I would place its return as forty sixty Kasi ang, ang indicator ko dun was the post-credit. Yung mismo final scene ng finale. Pinakita yung ano eh, yung picture nila Milo at Bisco na kinuna ng isang uh, yung isang stop ng checkpoint. You used to remember that. Ano eh, parang ang nagpaalam na talaga eh. Looks like Milo and Bisco won't be coming back to Imihama for for a very long time. And if you deep dive into that more, They now probably have the liberation of Japan as their as their primary goal. Pero they're going to do it one prefecture at a time. Kasi <clears throat> sobrang pagsisinungaling na ang ginawa eh. At ang naging mitya nito si Kurokawa. So they they probably need to to clean up Kurokawa's mess in in other parts of Japan. So yeah, that will make a, that will make a great storyline for season 2. Pero I wouldn't keep my hopes up, Maka Lifestyle. Sabi ko, Ibisco, it's done. So, thank you, us, for giving us, wow, one of the, one of the best animes at least this year. Talagang, you, 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 you got a winner here. Oz, you really got a winner here. So, again, probably for the final time, Sabi ko, Ibisco, finale, Two thumbs up. Another two thumbs up.
thumbs up all for the final time for Bisco Mama lifestyle. Bisco, 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 Bisco. And to think na, wow, okay. Bisco now has this god tier, uh, this, this god tier power inside of him na he can actually, he can now actually produce Sabi Kui from his own, from his own body. Kasi sinabi niya dun na may tumutubo na lang nasabi ko, nasabi ko sa kanya eh. Hindi niya alam eh. Well, it grosses him out. <laughs> it grosses him out. Eh, bilang mo tumuha ka ba naman ng food jar sa katawan? <laughs> Kung, hindi, hindi ka pa ma, hindi ka pa ma, hindi ka pa matatakot nun. Right? So, baka, baka kala na iba punggal infection yung, <laughs> yung, uh, yung tumutubo sa'yo. Baka layuan ka, baka layuan ka pa eh. So, yeah. Well, we'll see. Basta, pero, personally, I'm not going to keep my hopes up uh, for Sabi Koy Bisco Season 2. For me, this anime is done. Okay? And it went out on a blaze of glory. So, Patreon, wait for my next upload. And for those of you who are still stuck with the CHD, well, ano ba ngayon? More, more finale reviews to come. So, enjoy this review. And I'll see you in the next one.